on. Run. Well, hello, friends. Wolfgore here, and welcome back to Chaos, the game mode in Seven Days to Die, where we get attacked by a horde every 10 minutes. We are on the morning of day 14, and I want to say Jen the Trader has just reset. So we're going to hoof our... You know what? I forgot the stuff to sell. <laughs> we're going to hoof our way back to the base. Let's actually drink one of these mega crushes to increase our movement speed. Let's grab all that stuff. We're going to sell her, and I'm pretty sure she just resets, so she'll have a new inventory of stuff that we can look through and potentially buy. And then we'll just find a place to set up for the incoming horde that we'll have in a couple minutes. <laughs> and uh, defend it there, and then uh, we'll just get into it. Let's see what we got. Ooh, she's got a weighted head mod right off the bat. That's awesome. Um, I want to look through, because we do have a Grandpa's Awesome Sauce, I want to look through and make sure uh, it's a good time to, to use that. Make sure there's stuff I want to buy before we go ahead and drink that $800 alcohol. <laughs> you know what? She does not have anything too amazing. I think we're going to hang on to our Grandpa's Awesome Sauce for another day. Let's just go ahead and get the coin that we can for what we have to sell. And we're up to 7000 It probably... We just did get 5000 so it probably would have been worth popping this. But you know what? That's fine. We'll still hang on to it for another day. Let's buy the structural brace. I'm sure we can find somewhere to put it. Weighted head mod for sure. We're still wearing fiber gloves, so why don't we pick up those scrap gloves I saw. I think with some level twos. Yeah, that's that's an upgrade right there. Let's grab this boiled meat. We're getting a little hungry, and I'm debating whether or not to buy this steel. Hmm. We're probably. I don't think we have any steel yet, and we're probably. Yeah, let's just buy it. I hope you come back and. See At some point, we're time. probably going to find some mod schematics that we want to craft that'll require steel. So let's just go ahead and invest in that now. Oh, hi, bud. Thought I heard something. And we need to find a place to shack up real quick. And I think we've defended in this mobile home before. Let's check this uh, little bag here real quick. Fine by me. And we should just be able to plug this hole up right here with cobblestone. And hopefully they'll come to the front door which should still be reinforced. Yes, it is. All right, here they come. Uh, man, it'd be nice to get a plate up above. Man, let's go. You know what? Where are they even hitting? Oh, shit. <laughs> That's awkward. Hi, buddy. I thought they were going to come to the front door. At least some of them, but no dice. Should we repair this? What do we even want to do here? This is not a great place to defend, and I should figure out an exit strategy, just in case things get bad. All right, the exit strategy is just figure it out. Let's take out these dogs. Make our shotgun shells count. All right, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put a block here. Let's reinforce that. And let's try and knock this block out here. I just need to get to a point where I can actually hit them with my melee weapon. And they're sure making it difficult. Oh, God! Oh, dear. That was too close. All right, let's repair this. I think the other entrance is fine. Getting attacked on two fronts <laughs> is kind of awkward. All right. I can work with this. We just gotta keep... Oh god, that's about to break. Oh god! Okay, this is getting real awkward real quick. <laughs> How we doing over here? Okay, we're doing fine over there. Let's just keep them back. Our shotgun's loaded. In case we need it. Alright, I think we successfully defended that hole. Where are they banging? There they are. Okay. Let me see if I can get this thing out of the way. Should be able to get some headshots in here. It's morning, but we still got to clean up the horde. That is the one redeeming aspect of the days being so short, is that at least the hordes don't last that long, right? <laughs> Alright, come on. Come on. All right, let's just bust this plate out here and go deal with them on foot. It should be just fine. Probably should have waited till I had full stamina, but you know what? Sometimes you got to risk it to get the biscuit. 
and you can take that to the bank. All right, so immediately let's start looking for a place to loot. Uh, inventory space is not super great, um, but we'll head home after this. Hopefully we'll have time. Let's take off this hunter mod and throw on our weighted head mod. Let's put the hunter mod on our blunderbuss just for the time being. Throw on these gloves, get rid of the old fiber gloves, and let's put this structural brace onto our pickaxe. I almost forgot um, repair kits, that's what they're called. I pulled out some stuff so we can craft some repair kits because we do have weapons and tools that are going to require those in the near future. Let's just do this place, it's right here, and we are burning daylight. Now let's dig up this cobble. I'm not sure if we should be digging up cement. I don't know if we're going to get to a point where we can ever effectively utilize cement, but for the time being, I think I'm just going to dig it all up when I see it, just to be on the safe side. I'd rather have it... Whoa! Holy shit, girl, that scared the fuck out of me. I'd rather have it and not need it than need it and not have it. You know what I'm saying? Whoa, this is awkward. Okay, so it looks like we jump up here in the grill. For God's sakes, let me up. And there's a ladder right here. Looks like this is how we get into the POI. Let's just check the roof. Sometimes there's purses and shit up here. <sighs> Should have just nerd pulled up here to begin with, but you know what? That's fine. Not a big deal. What's up, buddy? Ooh, level one wrench. Uh, what's the block damage? 41 versus 37. That's actually an upgrade. Let's go ahead and scrap our level one wrench, and we don't need another claw hammer. Let's scrap that too. The iron is more valuable to me than the potential coin. Ooh, eight sledgehammer parts. We can sell those for sure. We're gonna have some friends here. Let's just close this door. Let them come to us. Hi. We are getting to a point where we can one-shot them, which is very, very nice. 10% more damage to wolves? Hell yeah, brother, let's do it. Hey, Lois. It's okay, you just lay there. We're gonna be fighting in here, so let's just kind of clear some of the junk out of the way. I don't want to get stuck and die because of that. That is not the way I want to go. So that's locked and reinforced, so let's come in here. Woo! Woo! Soldier zombie! Oh god, they're so scary. Right, he dead. Let's take this bed apart real quick. Ooh, nice ammo pile. And we got a wall safe. Let's go ahead and take this bed apart first. And then we can crack into that bad boy. Uh, wooden bow. Let's just scrap that. Scrap the arrows for the iron. Take these parts to sell. Throw out some of this crap that we don't need. Looks like there's a basement to this place. That might be the best place to fight. Uh, but if we fight in the basement, we'll be trapped down there, potentially. Let's just poke our head down there and see what it looks like. And decide where we want to fight the horde. Maybe up on the balcony might be the best place. There was a narrow staircase, which will... We could just be able to fight them one by one. We fight up there, which I like. But I gotta make a decision soon. We did get infected there, but we found some honey a minute ago, so that's perfect. Let's just eat the honey, and we got a small abrasion. Not a big deal. Somebody's making a lot of noise. I don't know if that's coming from outside or what, but... Not too much I can do about it at this point. Oh, shit, uh... Uh, you know what? We don't have time for this. They're just gonna have to come to us. Let's get upstairs. Holy shit, there's so much noise. Let's get upstairs right here. Hi. Where'd you come from? Okay, just you. Let's, uh... Try to reinforce this somehow. Maybe we can put a block right there. And then upgrade all of these. Oops. Oh boy. I sure wish that was a reinforced block. Not a frame block. Not good. Alright. Not good. Not good. Not good. Not good. There's no door there. Oh good lord. Okay. Okay. We're fine. You know what? We're fine. 
We just need to... No, we are not. No, we are not. Okay, we gotta go. We gotta go. First horde... <laughs> First horde fight on foot. All right, this is exciting. I need to get up to somewhere safe and not mess up. Okay. Let's get up here. Very good. All right, let's go deal with Kenny. And try and get some kind of reinforced structure going on that we can fight behind. Hopefully they're not just going to bust through the walls. Oh, God. <laughs> well, there they are. <laughs> there they are. Let's see if we can get this reinforced. I kind of doubt it. Kind of doubt it. Oh, my God. This is a mess. This is a mess. Holy shit, the balls. Okay. Let's try and thin them out. Oh my god. <laughs> gotta go! <laughs> we gotta go, we don't have a choice. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. What's even gonna happen? They're gonna come up here. Let's try and get the spider monkey taken care of. <sighs> okay, can't fall here. Cannot fall here. Try and take him out with some melee. Oh god! Okay, low on stamina, let's get around the corner, regen a little bit, keep our eyes peeled. We still have to get back in there and get the main loot. Alright, thick. You seemed eager to die, so let's take care of you first. Good lord, good lord, this is absolutely insanity. Okay, dead, 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 dead. Let's go clean this up, get inside, grab that main loot. We might as well stop by Jen's real quick and probably sell the junk that we have. Maybe. Just because we're still in the neighborhood. Whew, got a loot bag, that's exciting. Oh my god, they're so close! Oh. I don't want to waste any more shotgun shells. Oh god, Lois, slow down. Slow down, girl! <sighs> Holy shit, the balls. Okay, gotta keep moving. Let's get this club repaired. Very important. Forged iron there, that's good. Uh, I need to make some room. Let's eat some food. Do a little bit of inventory management. Let's move our mod onto our nice new chest piece. Take this forged iron. Let's get back downstairs. There's still some dogs down here, so... We need to be aware of that. Hold still, buddy. Pop a frame block down there. And see what's in the boxes. Steroids and a splint. Shamway Foods crate. Uh, garbage ass sandwiches. Another Shamway Foods crate. More shit sandwiches. A little bit of raw meat and some good water. That's pretty nice. Uh, let's throw out these cotton seeds for the water and this paper for the raw meat. Weapons bag. Come on, give me something good. Level 5 sledgehammer. I guess I'll sell that. Let's just drink some shit to make room. And check the last box. More stuff to sell. Just gonna throw out this cement. That might be a bad idea, but... Oh well. We can get a bunch of iron from these dumbbells. Or barbells. Let's do that. And get over to Jen's very, very, very quickly. I guess we'll go find another place to to loot and try and shack up there. Or maybe we should try and get back home and dump off some stuff. Man, it's so hard to make good decisions when you're having to play at this pace. <laughs> I, I'm completely winging this entire series. I have no idea if I'm making good decisions or not. Uh, no sugar butts. You're Hi, Jen. Did she reset? She did reset. Okay, we need to look through her inventory real fast. She's got some steel. We could buy that. Ooh, 260 gunpowder. Let's buy that. That is going to allow us to make some pipe bombs. 49 shotgun shells. Yeah, let's go. And in the secret stash, we've got a fireman's almanac. 10% greater. Nope, don't need that. Normally a triple pocket mod would be great, but I don't care about that right now. Let's grab the barbed wire mod. It's not the best, but it's going to help. Let's grab that mod and... 
definitely the batter up book. Uh, 44 mag schematic. Uh, yeah, sure. Let's buy one of those and this level one pistol. We can use the pistol to use up our 9 mil ammo for the time being. And we can always scrap it later for pistol parts so we can craft one of those 44 mags. Which could potentially be good. Uh, if nothing else, it'll allow us to use up our 44 magnum ammo. And I think we're going to try and make it home and do the horde in our little horde base. That might be a mistake. If we could get some explosives going, I'd feel a lot more comfortable fighting there. But we'll see what happens. All right, we gotta go. We gotta go real fast. Oh man, I really pushed it there. Really pushed it. All right, if I recall correctly, we added a ladder around back, which is how we get in now. Let's go ahead and replace our axe with our hammer. Let's upgrade that to cobble and get inside. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, what kind of death trap have I created for myself? Holy shit, that's a lot of dogs. Okay. Uh. Oh, those bars were about to break. Let's deal with Mr. Dog here. Um. I need to put a point into Demolitions Expert. Let's make sure nothing's about to break. Uh, let's try and craft some pipe bombs. Oh no, I need a workbench for that. F. F's in the chat. Man, our little sledge turret is not doing as much work as I hoped. Kind of wanted him to push them around the corner, but you know what? That's okay. At least he's dealing some damage, which, you know, it's something. God, this is such an awkward setup. I want to hit them in the heads, not in the knees, but I really don't have that option right now. All right. Well, you know what? We cleared them out very quickly. That's that's awesome. Oh, God, I'm so tempted to spend another day working on this horde base, trying to improve it. Oh, should I, should I, should I? Maybe I should. All right, well, let's get 24 pipe bombs crafting. Let's craft out some more short iron pipes, because we are out of those. All right, we're going to do it. We're going to improve this base just a little bit more. Hopefully, I can get to a point where I'm happy with it today. Uh, at least relatively happy with it. So let's get this up to cobble. Okay. We invested another day into the sword base. Uh, I added a hatch in the front here so we can now come in and out right here. And I... Mm, should I upgrade that to iron? Maybe. I don't know. Let's not think about that right now. I added a layer of cobblestone all the way around this place. So that should dissuade them from trying to go in the sides, I hope. We have double iron bars right here up front. And I'm thinking about adding another layer of cobble right around here. Um, but, you know, let's not worry about that for right now. Let's just see what happens tonight. Uh, they're about to be here, so I'm going to run back to the base, make sure I'm all full, got all the stuff that I want, and we'll just see how this goes. Plus, we've got 27 pipe bombs now, which is going to help a lot. Let's put our punchy right down there. That should help. Let's go ahead and craft another iron hatch. Let's just get this up to iron. I, in case zombies get up on the roof, I really don't want to die by having this weak-ass hatch break. Oh, hi! And it does look like they're coming for the front entrance here, which is fantastic. Uh, using Punchy might be kind of questionable, though. Because he's going to make it harder to get value out of these pipe bombs. Let's see what happens when we go on the roof. Do oh, hi! Do they scatter? Hey, knock it off. Uh... <laughs> that went nice. Let's do one more. Oh, baby. I love pipe bombs. They are so damn good. So it did look like they were attacking to the left of the hatch. I'm curious if Punchy 
is messing with them or not. Let's uh, let's try and pick him up. You know what? I can't. I can't pick up Punchy. Let's just deal with them and uh, learn what we can learn from this. Alright, they did knock out that cobblestone block, but I'm kind of fine with that. Why don't we try and get a pipe bomb? Oh, that was perfect. Oh, God. That was nasty good. Oh, good lord. Oh, no, mistakes were made. Why won't this fucking hatch open? This is not good. Holy shit. Dude, I swear, I was looking right at that hatch and it would not open. And I did not realize that block was about to break. <laughs> Have that. Oh my god. Get back. Oh, total panic mode. Total panic mode. No. No. Is my weapon broken? Okay. We need to make a little space. We need to make a little space. We're fine. We're fine. I know this looks bad, but we're fine. Weapons repaired. Just take them on one at a time. <sighs> Shit. Shit. You know what? Okay. That didn't go <laughs> that bad. <laughs> like, it went bad. <laughs> but it didn't go that bad. Right? Let's grab all these loot bags, see what kind of goodies we got. Cornmeal, you can fuck right off. I got no time for your bullshit, cornmeal. Let's see, it, we started day 14, so I think we'll call it uh, tomorrow morning. Let's do one more day, and I think I'm actually going to put a little bit more time into this base. This is starting to go well, and I think I'm just going to kind of double the situation I've got here. I'm going to put more bars here and another hatch here, which is kind of weird and not how I would normally do it. Um, but that's just how we're going to do it today. Because I don't have time to think of anything better. Alright, that took about all of our forged iron. Uh, do we want to reinforce these blocks anymore? Like, maybe put some cobble right here. And right here. Maybe do, like, a frame thing up here to try and keep them from getting up on the roof like they were. Yes, let's do this. Let's go grab some more cobble. And I'm going to throw some more iron in the forge. Because we need some more forged iron. Yeah, that's fine. Let's put a little bit more wood in there. Ah, oh, shit. Our forge is out of clay. So let's dig up some clay real fast. Two-shotting. That's not good enough. We have nine skill points. Let's go ahead and put a couple points into mother load, a couple points into minor 69er. Now we're talking. You know what? We got the skill points. Why don't we just try and max these perks out? We're going to have to try and get some more iron tomorrow. So I would rather have these close to maxed out. That's just going to make collecting iron even easier. We'll just hang on to that skill point for now. Let's dig up a little bit more clay. Alright, we got... A little bit of iron there from wrenching some cars and stuff. Let's try and get a little bit more base reinforcing done. And then I think we are going to have a pretty successful horde night. Fingers crossed. Not sure why I picked up Punchy, but let's get him back down. The horde is here. Alright, he's right there. Let's get inside. And... Our ladder got busted last night, so let's go ahead and replace that before we forget, in case I screw up again. You're going to want to be able to get out of here. Alright, I think we're good. Let's bring down some pipe bombs and get to killing. Alright, they're all pooling up over here, it sounds like. Let's get up on the roof. Oh, god damn it! get off my roof, you little assholes. Let's drop a pipe bomb down right into that. Nice. Uh... Man, a lot of them survived that. Let's give them another one. 
<laughs> Eternally satisfying. Man, they really want to come through this area for some reason. I hate it. You assholes. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Get out of here, you bitch. All right. Oh, God, that's a cop. Oh, God, that gun is not loaded. Kill him, please. <laughs> oh, why are they going for the goddamn walls? <sighs> we need to get some concrete going. If we want to keep investing in this base, the cobblestone walls just aren't going to cut it. God damn it. Fuck off, Thick. They're piled up again. Let's try and get one more good pipe bomb. Then we can go finish them off on foot. The dog's just booking it. He heard me say pipe bomb and he was like, nah, I ain't about that shit. Oh, Jesus. Fuck off, dog. Alright, we chilling? Chilling. I really wish I had a bandage. We do have some at the base. By the time we get there, we're probably going to stop bleeding. So, uh, nope. There we go. There, saved like two damage. <laughs> and we're addressing the abrasion, which helps. And healing up. Okay, let's see what's in the bag. Level 2 Steel Sledgehammer. Very cool. And a bunch of ammo. That's pretty awesome. Um, God, I sure wish we had a pump shotgun. This double barrel is pretty sweet, but... Two shots is not a whole lot. Uh, let's go ahead and get strength up to seven. Let's take a point in sexual Tyrannosaurus. I've got a bunch of various goods on us, and we're just going to go find a place to loot just for the hell of it. Maybe we'll maybe we'll do that big shotgun messiah over there just because we can. I don't know how well this is going to go. I don't know if this is incredibly stupid. It probably is, but yeah, we're going we're gonna to loot the shotgun messiah HQ today. Fuck it. All right, here we are. Let's just bang on the front door and uh, see what happens. Anybody home? Surprisingly not. Well, we have a safe here. Let's break into it. What's in the box? We got a triple pocket mod, a reflex sight, and some shotgun shells. That's freaking dope. Uh, let's put... Nope, I can't put that on there. Can I put this on my blunderbuss? No, I cannot. Okay. Um, let's throw this pocket mod onto our gloves. Not that it really does anything, but it just kind of gets it out of our inventory. And let's keep looting and making a little distance between us and the walls that the zombies are going to be trying to break through any minute now. Hello? Oh, you're dropping down from the ceiling on me. I see how it is. Hi, Lois. Oh, you're feral. Tough girl. Anything in this locker? Nothing that I'm too interested in. Let's keep closing these doors behind us. For obvious reasons. The danger that's going to be on our heels any minute now. Coffee, that's good. We can use that for the horde night. We've got a little courtyard here. And a spear hunter book. Sure, let's just read it and grab this stuff. Keep moving. Where do I go from here? Looks like this window's busted out. What's the hit points like? 3,000 on these. 7,000. Ooh. Ooh. This place is actually really well built. That's awesome. Okay. Okay, I'm starting to feel a bit more confident about coming here. Let's try and get this, this room cleared out before friends show up. Oh, shit. That's a lot. That's a lot. Okay, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. That's a lot. Oh, God, that's, that's great. My shotgun wasn't loaded. That's exactly what I was going for in that situation. God damn it. Why is my shotgun never loaded? Why am I like this? Why is my blunderbuss not loaded? Why am I like this? Uh, we got a sprain. Sprained leg. Okay, no sprinting. That's okay. We are going to be pretty much stationary. For the next few minutes, anyways. Let's uh, see what's in this. <sighs> Block damage. Yeah, you didn't see that. You didn't see that. Okay, maybe we should try and bottleneck this right here. Let's just put some blocks down. 
Upgrade them to cobble. And I honestly have no idea what direction they are going to come from. But we're going to find out. Maybe I should put a hatch in the middle, just in case they end up coming from this side. That way we can get on the other side of the hatch. It's probably a good call. I am hearing them on this... Oh! <laughs> yep! Goddamn. Goddamn. Nope. Okay, gotta run. Sure wish my leg wasn't fucked up. Get back. Get back. Get back. Get back. So get back. Okay, 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 okay. We're gonna get we're gonna get on the other side of this door. We're gonna put a block down. Boy, I did not get prepared in time for that. Um Cobble is not gonna hold them for that long, and I don't have my hammer with me. I could nerd pull up into the ceiling and just kind of get away from them. But I'd like to avoid taking the coward's route. Uh what the hell happened to our leg? We have a broken leg, and we're fatigued, and we're infected. We've gotta get back to the shop and get into our medicine cabinet. We cannot clear this place under these conditions, but I am determined to clear this place this episode. Man, why are they never... Why can they never just... Oh, God damn it! Oh, oh, this is what I was afraid of. This is my nightmare. No, no, no. <laughs> no, 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 please, please, God. <sighs> I was not proactive there. I was not proactive. I should have gone over to the other door rather than screwing around and put a block in front of it. Oh, no! Rippers, dude. Well, friends, that concludes uh, our Chaos series, at least the first one. I really enjoyed this game mode. I feel like I learned a lot from it. It's helped me improve my, like, quick thinking, just thinking on my feet, which is something I kind of lack. Um, but I think we'll revisit this game mode in the future. Our next series is going to be more of a, a long-form, typical survival, insane nightmare. I'm not sure if we're going to do Horde every night. It would be kind of nice to take a break from Horde every night. But I'll give it some thought. Fuck you, Crawler. I just punched that Crawler in the head like twice and his head exploded. That was sick. But yeah, I hope you guys really enjoyed this Chaos series as much as I did. If you would like to see another Chaos series in the future, uh, let me know down in the comments. And uh, I can definitely make that happen. But all that being said, I love your faces. Thank you so much for being here. And I will see you next time. Bye.